What's going on everybody and welcome back to The Walking Dead 400 Days. Last video we were playing as Russell, uh, Russell, shit, uh, Wyatt and Vince. In this episode we're going to be attempting to finish off this episode with bon Bonnie, Russell, and Shell. I'm playing this immediately after the last video because it, I kind of don't really like this episode all that much. I usually skip it, so, yeah. Because it's literally just cameos for episode, um, one of season two. I am recording, right? Yes, I am. Russell, 184 days in. There's actually an Easter egg to a familiar face in this episode, or this moment. Uh, I would recommend opening up your map there, Russell, but alright. Hey! Getting up? Good. Yeah, anyway, I'll try to finish this episode off because I don't think we have much left. We only have the raid characters to play as, and they're quick as hell. I think uh, Russell takes the longest. Either Russell or Bonnie. Shell literally takes nothing. Now, if I hide, we can actually see an old familiar face. Oh god, I didn't need to see that before the fucking maggot. Jesus. It's fucking Carly. It's Carly, holy shit. So, yeah, yeah, so nice little Easter egg scene with your old character. I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. I don't want any trouble. I don't want no trouble, please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I, I'm not a nigger feel like, buddy. Russell, ass wipe, or it doesn't matter, ass wipe. I was gonna say you look like an ass wipe. Ass wipe ain't got any man. His mom of ass wipe didn't teach him any man. But maybe she named you Russell, and you didn't lose the manners till later in life. Unless you stole that. No, I just want to say my name is Asswipe. What the hell's the problem here? I don't care who you steal from. If you did, maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? No. You got some boys wearing hoodies. I gotta worry about. I'm not in a gang. You steal from me it's I mine. I didn't steal it. I don't care who you run around with. You understand? It's mine. I didn't steal Dude, this guy's a dick. Right. Good. I don't like. You. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on, scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Wait, David Statesboro. Alright, I wanna fucking shoot this fucker. Great. Just get in, we'll get there. Or somewhere, eventually. Do I have the option to beat the ever loving shit out of him? Because I want it already. Uh, no. Here you go. I'm good. <laughs> I'm straight, man. You're not uptight, are you? This is the fucking apocalypse. This is like no, no. I'm just good, all right. All right. No, and you seem a bit of like a dick. Back where you come from? Maybe drop you off and do a double back. Why does I just say fuck you to this guy? Because I already wanted to say it. No tail. No tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked. The argument semantics for us. Give a pal the deeds. Alright. There's seven of us. I didn't have any family there. They're all my grandson in Statesboro. There was a dad and a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop. Nobody really believed him. And a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number. He didn't add nobody. We found survivors. Same every time. Eat. Eat. Let it 
that, Paco. Just, we gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang, they'd be dead. Anyway, I couldn't handle it. Yeah. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for grands alone and try to find my family. Yeah, you really sound a bit like a dick. Take away to this guy. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, Jesus fucking hell! How would you give her? Strong six. Oh my six. god. I was the rat. Let's have him say fuck you to this guy, because I want to. Just a taste. Okay, I say fuck you to you, this guy. You're fucking rude, yeah, yeah, he fucking is. Well, I just met you. My God, Jesus Christ! This dude, this dude's probably the biggest asshole so far. What the fuck? What the hell? Um, bro, that's the fucking zombie. You fucking fucking hell! Please, Christ, you fucking that's a fucking zombie, you dick bag. Fucking fuck you, you fucker. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Tell me where the fucking bullets are. I got you just smet. You, you know what? Yeah, I think we're gonna fucking use it on you. Dude. Jesus. Did this guy have to be this much of an asshole? Because I want to shoot him. Badly. Like, I don't give a shit. This dude needs to be shot and just be left for dead. My god, man. You know, I... Even Lily would fucking hate this guy. And I didn't get along with Lily, but I think me and Lily would have something in common here. Larry as well. No one fucking likes this du dude. Uh, fuck you. Shut your ass. Not mad. I'm out of here. Fuck this place. Oh shit. Oh shit. What the fuck? Um. You have bullets? You got bullets this time? Don't think about it. Just run. I'll keep his fucking head down. Oh shit, I mean, guess not a no real time to argue. Fuck. Oh what the That's fuck, dude? What happened to I'll cover you? For real. You fuck you, Nate. I shouldn't have come with you. Oh, it's too fucking late now. Fair enough. Relax, I wanna kill you. Come on, kid. Severely, more than Larry. Ah, uh, fine. This is no big deal. We got this, okay? Okay. First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. All right, cool. Down. Found him. See, easy. Now we know where he is. We can fucking get him. All right. Yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. okay. Oh shit. Shit! Damn it. Wait, well, this is the guy in the truck from Wyatt's storyline. I just thought of that. Because of the broken uh, headlight. You gonna cover me? You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Oh yeah, I'll cover you. That's fine too. Oh fuck yeah, I will. Oh, I'll cover you for sure, buddy. Yep, hundred percent, you fucker. Oh, I'll keep someone's fucking head down. Wait. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Damn it, Russ, what's the goddamn hold? Oh, come on, are you serious? All right, Russ, you got me with my balls out. That's good. Good one, kid. I was off to just shoot his ass. <gasps> Big Russ! I'm fucking... <laughs> fucking out. You hear me? 
I'm leaving your ass. Oh, come on, Russell. Cut the shit. And fuck you. Look, I need you right now, all right, Russ? This ain't the time to fuck around. Okay, yeah, I was an asshole before. You think? You know, I was just trying to loosen you up. You're my boy, right? Fuck no! Fuck you! You nasty. Fuck me, I saved your ass. You didn't save shit. You're gonna get me killed. Mm hmm I like to fuck yourself. I do, okay? But we're in a fucking pickle here. And I'm telling you, we get through this and, well, I'll work on that first impression you got. Okay? Fine. I'm gonna give you this gun back now. And you're gonna shoot at this guy. I would prefer to shoot in your ass, but alright. Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! We're trying to shoot so we don't have any bolts of damn gun left. Alright, fine. Go. Oh fuck. Good job. Now we get over there and we go. Good. Go. Shit. At least we're alive. Thanks. We're not done yet. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this asshole. Follow me. I hope we just had a first, a, a first, a bad first impression. That's kind of what I'm hoping for, and he's not actually this much of a douchebag. We gotta get in there. But he's still a douchebag. Oh shit, it's that uh cop. We should put it out. It's fucking dead. Come on. Feel like a big man now? Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. Mm-hmm. I think you're a bit of an asshole, but alright. Okay, just one guy, I see. I think I saw a guy. Oh shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Oh, I sneak up. Just jump out and grab him. You're calling. Alright, we're trying to sneak up on him. Nudge the left stick forward gently to sneak up, up quietly. Push the left stick forward. Alright. I'll gently push it. Man, that is fucking... Oh, I Jesus. Don't fucking move! Wolf! Ow! Get the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa. The fuck happened here? I told you not to come back here. Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook. First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food. You've lost your the goddamn fuck? She's dying, and now she can see your... What's he talking about? Mask. What's he talking about? Yeah, hold on. I know. He's crazy. Have you been here before? He's been fucking been here before. Man. Anything we should take you out for that. Please just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Yeah. 
Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Fuck you! And fuck you, Nate. Where's that option? Are you fucking serious? Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up. There are real fucking monsters out there. No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I see. Fuck you, Nate. I saved your ass. You didn't do shit. Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. <sighs> I'm not surprised, honestly. I hope this guy's fucking dead now. I hope he's fucking dead. Alright, and that's the end for Nate's story. Piece of shit. Alright. There we go. Now let's get into Bonnie's story. A character who will get an actual role in season 2. No matter what you do. So, here we go. Yeah, and this is kind of the most... This is possibly the worst one. I don't really care for playing Bonnie's story. A snake for a tongue. You are so what? Bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Oh. Or lobster claws for hands? Bonnie, tw 220 days in. What kind of fucking question? Are the claws... Are the claws lobster size or human size? Human yes. size? They make this easy on you. Well... I'm thinking... Lobster claws need their snake to think harder. Lobster claws. Weirdo. Think of all the crazy stuff you could grab. What I'm saying is, good luck finding a man if you have lobster hands. Good thing I'm not looking for one then. Okay. How about no, never mind. We probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look uh, better. You gotta admit anything that's been proven. That came out wrong. What I mean is... <laughs> what, what, I mean, take a... You were... Thanks? You were, what, what? What the hell are we talking about? Thanks, jerk. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Oh, to remind me how hideous I was. Make sure you keep on keeping up. I mean it. After we found you, we were still so hooked on that stuff. Oh. I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the that way. That was a I know. druggie. Got it. You've come a long way, Bobby. I'm proud of you. <laughs> a real poster child. Yeah, I'm a real poster child. I can see you on a brochure. Oh, like the ones at the dentist? Before and after, with a puffy face and yellow teeth. Just look at her now. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. I'm kind of worry. You know that, right? I know, so I don't what you're saying. I know. Sure. <sighs> I really don't. Thank you. I just met this guy. Do I fully... Leland? I don't really Bonnie? care. D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? You, the lobsters or oh, lobsters? Um, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters. Well, fish. Figured it'd be worth a shot. And food. You know. Leland, you hate fishing. That ain't <laughs> totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. But you didn't. I am a catch. I know. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we gotta get moving. What the hell is that? Does she think girlfriend? Doesn't she think me? So, where'd you get the bag, Pete? Pete? It's in the bag. Let's just keep moving. I'll go, Leland. Hey, D. When we get back to camp, would you let me borrow?
Wow, this is kind of a. Wow, man, this is just. interrupt the girl talk here, but Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off. Was anyone there? Did you steal it? Could be so cagey. Was anyone there? I don't think so. You don't think, or you don't know. Wow, this is such a downgrade between uh, Russell and uh, Bonnie. I really like playing as Russell. I really don't give a shit playing as Bonnie. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week, the last month. All right. Uh. Remember one especially, but I know I had false. This is how all our fights go every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? We really should get going. We should get moving. But you are the one who made me stop. Irregardless, we can just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that. Enough, come on, I'm leaving in a minute. Draw walkers. Draw walkers, assholes. You listen to me now. I have had it up to here with listening to you. I can't believe you are still. I'm out here. Fuck this. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. We can sort this out. Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will, right, D? We we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bonnie, darling, I'm I'm sorry. We're darling. B, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours too. B, now's not the time. I'm not getting into this. We got. We'll hash them out later. It's always later. I, I refuse to get in the middle of this. Well, too bad. You already are. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can. Oh God! Run! Come on! We gotta move. What, what the fuck? Like, oh shit! Oh, shit. Fuck this! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit. oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh okay, great. I'm fucking shot. This is just great. I actually forgot Bonnie just trying to this episode. Yeah, this is again. This is the only character who actually returns. And actually plays a huge role in season two, but um, has the worst uh, storyline. Ow! Ow! That was weird. But yeah, this is kind of a just get through this episode. This is the only episode I kind of struggle to get through because you don't meet this character so much after this episode. Oh shit! Oh shit! There's D and. Fuck. Ah, okay. oh, shit. Um. Hey, Through here. Look. Fuck. Now I think. Where the hell? Shit. If you hear just right, we're in the next episode. <laughs> what the fuck? <gasps> shit, that scared me. Yeah, I think. If you listen just right, Let that guy yeah, who just talked, I believe that's Carlos from season two, where it's the same voice actor. They sound very f similar. Where are you? I swear that has to be Carlos. Just he puts on an accent when he plays him. Well, that's the actual voice actor. Oh shit! Is there? Yeah, this is this is why just walking down. No, no, can we get somewhere, please? I feel like we're just running circles here. Ah oh, shit. Okay, let's get. Oh, fuck. Okay, tractor per. Okay, there's Rybar just in the middle of fucking nowhere. Watch over me. Oh shit. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. Oh, there's 
There's some rebar here for some fucking reason, just in the middle of nowhere. Okay, we can use this. Alright, let's beat the shit out of somebody. Oh, shit. Motherfucker! Well, I think they're dead. Whoever the fuck it was. Oh, shit. Uh. Oh, God. Uh. I didn't know it was you. Oh, shit. I didn't know it was you. Uh, it's just your right eye that looks totally fucked. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Oh shit, D, I'm sorry. I. Jesus, I'm, I'm sorry. I did not mean to actually kill you. I really did not mean to fucking kill you with a piece of rebar. God, I'm so sorry. So in the middle of fucking nowhere. I don't know how that got there, but okay. It was an accident, you're right, I like him, it was just an accident, it was an accident. It really was an accident, I didn't mean to, to kill you. Ah, oh, shit. I swear, this has nothing to do with him, it was an accident. Fucking junkie. D, D, did you find her? Honey, they got you back there. Jesus, are you a shot? Yeah, they fucking shot me and I, uh... Accidentally killed your wife. God, what happened? I, oh, I accidentally. I, I um. What happened to you? I found it like this. I had to do it. It doesn't matter. I had to. I, I thought you would. What do you mean, Bonnie? What was that you just said? It was an accident. It really was an accident, Leland. It, it really. It was me, yeah, I didn't fucking mean to kill her. Is there forever? I need you, Leland. We can't stay here forever. Shit. I think I saw something over here. Yeah, we better get fucking going. What are you doing? gonna turn? I'm not... I think she will, but I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, yikes. That was a... kind of painful, but alright. Let's get into Shell, who I actually like playing as, and a character I actually like. Again, I like everybody here, except... I like playing as everybody other than Bonnie. Maybe because... what well, Bonnie does in Season 2 is why I don't like playing as her. She does something pretty effed up. And I know how I would have actually played in, into this with uh, Season 2. You can actually play into this where I could think of a little better storyline on how you can make the 400 days characters. Probably play a role in Season 2. Oh shit, my computer is actually almost dead. I better hurry this episode up. It's at 38%. Or my laptop anyway. It's 
pretty fucking low. I better get this done quick. I love how I just went and, went and get my fucking charger, but whatever. I don't think about that shit beforehand. What the hell do you think? I have a brain? Shell, 236 days in. But here's a good thing I actually like playing as. Better than me. I can't play shit. Just because I don't try to, honestly. Sorry, Trace, I'm trying to protect her. I don't know. She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times. She's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. They actually like these characters versus the Bonnie storyline. Like, I understand why they brought it in, but I like this. That sounds like a great idea. I like that idea. Get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music. I swear, this is Carlos. Carlos's voice actor sounds very similar to him. In that case, let's get back to work. I don't know why I actually like this group. This is actually probably my personal favorite oh, storyline. Hard work on the vegetable garden. We're having. And I hope these people look a little familiar to you, because they are, because they are the Kansas Survivors group. You, you know, the fuckers who took our boat from episode five. Fuck you guys. I'll look over the guns. There. Okay, but be careful. People's lives depend on those. We can't have them screwing up because we got lazy. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Watchdogs? What? Sure. What are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. Good. Let's look at flashlights. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. Mmm. I hope uh, you, you have been paying attention because this all correlates. All, every single person, they all are connected to this gas station. Conveniently. Oh, here we go. Oh, you scared me. He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feet. Why? That is fucking disgusting, Jesus. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, yeah, it's Jesus. That you wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't I prefer not to. Listen, I know you think it's fucking an easy life. What's no, it's just disgusting. I don't want to see her see zombie eat people. It's better than the alternative. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how Guess to so. herself, that's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that. God, this is gross. And again, if you've been paying attention about these decisions, that zombie is someone familiar. It's that cop from earlier in season in this episode. I believe it's the cop we killed as Wyatt. Oh, or trying to save us Wyatt. It feels like they put the most effort into this, into Shell's storyline. I don't know why, but it feels like they put the most effort and the littlest effort into Bonnie's. <laughs> oh, Jesus, don't wow. Ever fucking do that again. <laughs> Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found. A, a oh, is that what it was? Yeah. I can't even tell what the hell it was. It just got to I, oh man, that, you know, 
that that's fucking sucks. So little. You don't think about like a little dog. Anymore, but after a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. Then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it, and. You know, it's kind of... That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. What is the point of those? Shell, Becca, something's going on outside. What is it? I don't okay, know. the fuck? We gotta find Roman. Who the hell is this guy? His wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No. Okay, so those things are actually do use are useful, huh? Who is he? Who the hell is he? No idea. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. Second break in we've had in the yeah. last couple of weeks. Last time could Gosh. Okay, that tells us our defenses are fucked. Just fucking bad. We all know what it's like trying to survive. Yeah. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. Send him on what, his what way. This, this motherfucker just trying to steal our shit. Yeah. That's right. He I mean, could be part of a larger group. Could let him. It's, dangerous, it's too dangerous to let him go. I mean. Too dangerous. Who knows if he has friends? I mean, the motherfucker tried. Don't you think we would have seen someone by now? At least trying to negotiate to get him back. That would. That is strange. That is strange. That doesn't mean anything. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree, and then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. Vernon no, was out they, the boat the whole sure. time. The second they left that boat unattended, we just stole it. I know. You bunch of dicks. You can't stay here. You are a bunch of bastards. Here is not an option. If I had an option, I would shoot y'all. Yeah, this dude gave me sus vibes. Here, so let's stop dancing around. We either let this guy yeah. go or take our chances. Or we kill him. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> I agree, it's gonna be one or the other, but I don't like it. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is I'm agreeing with Boyd him. Stephanie, Boyd. I agree, Boyd. You two don't think we should kill him. Oh no, Boyd. Uh what's the guy's name? The other guy. Jo Glive, that's his name. Yeah, I agree with Clive, man. I mean Sam Frey will kill him. I hate to kill him, but I can't risk it. Can't fucking risk it. Yeah, it's fucked up, but it might be safer. Yeah. If only, and he doesn't speak English. We can't. I don't think any of us speak any other language. Keep him here. I can't let him go. Nope. Telling folks that might try to hurt us. Can't yeah. Them. Won't ask you to watch. If we do this, all right. we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. All right. I don't want to risk it. It's fucked up, but you can't take a risk like that. Shit. 258 days in. So that's uh. Do you have any? Wait, did we start out? That's that us. 222 days. Was that it? <laughs> I really don't remember. Nope. You say about two weeks passed. I think. 
I didn't. Uh, shit. Shit. When did when, when did the start? Yep. Yep. Here. I miss playing guitar for everyone. I mean, it was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's still focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. I mean. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time. Well, that better. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break ins already. Yeah, two break ins. Anyone can in within a year. If someone sees you and, and follows you back here. They won't. Damn it, Becca. Oh, God. It's open. All right. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. So, okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. We can talk here. We can talk here. No, just finish up here. And come find me. Don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Don't know. Probably not good though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Like I said, this feels like, like actually thought out more. Like I'd actually kind of like to play a full episode with these characters. Everyone else, I don't hate them. You know, I actually liked Wyatt for how long he got it, but you get so many short stories. You know, there's Boyd. Hey. What? Fucking hey? Romans got her locked up like some kind of animal. They what the fuck? Escape. They actually use that word. Escape. Boy, calm down. Yeah, I'm hold on. That stuff's up. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. And now look what we are. I'm gonna go talk yeah, to it's one of us. Know, that is different. Get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things no, are I'm actually agreeing with boy now. Like. It's different when it's one of our guys. Like, if it's one of ours who's trying to leave, there might be a fucking reason. Not, you know, not. Like, yeah. There's some. That's some. That's a. Hey, I heard about Stephanie. Why did she have to do that? We're safe here. There's no reason to want to leave. I'm sure she had her reasons. I'll yeah. Roman. We'll figure it out. The hell? I um, I don't. I think something's off about that. Just well, head off. Good. You're here. So it's funny. Yeah. Sorry. That's so. Uh, what are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. So what? Maybe she needs to get out of here. So what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. Now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. Now I think we can let her go. She's not a part of another group. You want me to take care of it? Yeah, I know. You said that next time it'd have to be one of us. You went along with it last time. You because because right we now. can't take a risk like that. This is different. It's one of ours. Hundred percent. Let's talk to her first. Get all the facts. Why she did it? No. She tried to sneak out. Leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She might have been right. Could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance. She might not try to leave so quietly. You got your gun? Uh, hell. It's in the camp. Yep. I ain't gonna do it. Do it. This is different. It's one of ours. You know, if one of us tries to leave, there might be a reason. 
you know. You say. It isn't like a slight disagreement. No, there's a reason why she tried to fucking, ex you know, leave. I'm agreeing with Boyd on this one. It might have been the right thing before, but again, that could have. That was just some random person. This is from the inside. It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies. I really should go get my fucking charger. My computer's literally dying right now. It's at 23%. I really need to go get my fucking charger. <laughs> ah, shit, I'm really gonna. I really need to go get it. Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Because. Because this place isn't fucking safe. Because this place isn't safe anymore. I, I Ever don't. since we killed that stranger, things have been different. Roman's not trying to protect us anymore. He's trying to control us. But it's I immediately so here. I mean, no, it ain't. Yeah, I want to get away every now and then, but I would never leave. That's crazy. Roman I don't know. Just it. It's different from someone outside and someone inside. You know, I'm trying to protect <laughs> us here. Guns over there. Yeah, maybe there's a fucking reason. Maybe they have a point. One of us tries to leave. You know, if she just said, I don't know, I don't really think this is a plan. You know, we don't have to no. do this. We can just go. I 100% agree. We should just go. We've survived this place isn't safe. Before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. I don't know. I really no longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. No name. I don't this want from this the... to be who we are. What the fuck? Okay. I'm sorry, just my computer just acted Fuck you. Like Alright, sorry, it scared the shit out of me. No, I'll do it. I don't want you to do this. Ever have yeah, I need to go charge my fucking. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shit. Drive away. What are you doing? I ain't. I ain't doing it. What the hell? Sit down. Get safe. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Shell, hey. Shell, safe out of yeah, no. Nope. I ain't risking it. Yeah, no. Nah, there, there might have been a reason, and I, I kind of agree with Boyd. Yeah, I really need to go charge my fucking computer. 400 days in, yeah, now I'm getting those characters like, I thought my computer just like fucking died on me. I'm like, oh, come on, I'm in a fucking video, man. Alright, yeah, we got a couple minutes left. I better go and fucking get my character here. It's literally at like what percentage? Uh, it's at, uh, 18%. Yeah, I better go get it. Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. Hmm. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. Yeah, uh, hopefully he didn't uh, screw up my audio either. Uh, I'll go look into it after this is done. Okay, that's what I'm really scared of, because I remember that fucking story mode video we made a little while back. Where I thought it was plugged in. I mean, it's plugged in, so... At least I made this. I think I made the decision to bring Vince in because I actually like his character. How did you find us? I found your note. All right. I just got my uh, charger for my. I'm a scout. 
computer and everything is good. Go out and look for survivors to rescue it. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. I'm gonna try and convince everyone to get to Carver's, although I think it is. Bonnie I think no one cares it doesn't really matter is Bonnie. Which, okay, right here, I think here, this right here should have been immediately, Bonnie's dis- I think Bonnie's dis- I think Bonnie's decision should have been how, um, like this decision right here with Bonnie should have been the decision that actually could lead into a different part or a different ending for episode 4 of season 2. Bring them in, whoever it was, if it's just- you know, if, because if she's honest, then you wouldn't get into a gunfight. Maybe you would actually have the 400 days characters with you. You know, that would make a very big impact into season two. That's what I would have done if I was doing episode four. But if you didn't bring certain characters along, just replace them. Just uh, replace them. Yeah, I know Shell, Bonnie, and Vince are going with me. Yeah, I know these no four coming with us him automatically. Been to that truck stop. There's no one left. Roman's not a problem. It's following her that'll get you killed. Look, I know it's a risk, but what else is there? And I think you don't even—it doesn't matter what you decide with uh, Wyatt or uh, Russell. You just have to talk to convince them just right. Well, it takes to convince you, then stay here if you want. I don't know. Russell, come on. Cause I actually like Russell. It seems cool. We need to get to this place. Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively. What we're gonna do? Eat you? That's. If you wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already. I had a gun and snuck right up. Well, what's stopping you? Exactly. Nothing. Look, I yeah. know you guys are wearing. I'm not that much of an asshole, guys. You know, I mean, I'm an asshole, but not that around. much of a piece of shit. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to <laughs> say, John's. Where are you, guy? <coughs> Lily. The choice is yours. It's automatically Vince, Wyatt, no, Vince, Shell, Becca, and Bonnie are coming with us. Let's go to shit I'm going Awesome, because I actually like you, Vince. You're probably my favorite out of all these. And you actually have to talk to him just right with uh, Bob, Russell, and Wyatt. Like I said, everyone's story is good other than Bonnie's, and no matter what I do, Bonnie will come with me. We've been out here for so long. We've seen so much bullshit. And is it really worth so. it? I hope so. Yeah, again, this is kind of like a, is this really the good ending? You know, is this really the good ending? Because you have a Carver. You know, is this really the good ending? Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. I don't even know if that's a real place in Georgia. Not gonna lie, never been there. I've literally never been to Georgia. Yeah, and if you're not lying, maybe, maybe Eddie will be there. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. No, Eddie's not there. He's over in Fort McCarroll. From Cow Ranch. Which is alright. Alright. So, do? wow, this is actually it for season one. Jesus Christ. We just made our final decision. We got everyone on board. I think the only decision them in the. And pretty much. It's a good thing. I know it is. Yeah. I think that's it. What's the alternative? You don't. I give you my word. I give you my word. And there it is. And only six months later, season two releases. Which is exactly how long we're going to take for this episode. Thank you guys so much. Anyway. Alright, here we go. Whose foot did you shoot off? 
30% shot Danny. Makes sense, because I actually like, because Danny did seem like a pretty cool guy, but I did originally shoot Justin, too. So, uh, did you stay in the car or get out? 50% got out of the car, because it's a 50-50 chance to win or lose. 75 left May. Who the fuck when he's a piece of shit? 25 or on? Really? Huh. And 75 left in an RV. Why would you actually lie to Leland? Left Octavia. Everybody. Who stayed at camp? No one. And there it is. And oh, th oh I forgot the credits are actually kind of like what happens after. Man, that wasn't that bad. I think the Bonnie storyline was kind of eh, but uh, yeah, it, it was all right. You know, not, not my favorite. This is probably if I had to rank them so far. I guess I, I get. You know, I can not have to give my full review of season one. Man, this season is just great. This was a good episode. It was a good tie into season two, one to two. And remember, that's t in tomorrow's video. That's season two. So, yeah, man. Just crazy. Love this season. Again, it's probably my personal favorite out of all, all of them. As my personal favorite character, has it's such a sad ending, the one I cry every single time I see it. Just, it's a good damn game. I didn't get any shitty sequels. It's been, hey, but The Walking Dead Show doesn't count because it's a spinoff. You know, and then, um, season two. I don't think season, season or not season two, New Frontier, I think is underrated, but, yeah, man. This is a damn good episode. Remember, a pretty good episode. So, this is what, alright, so, if I had to rank, uh, rank all the episodes, it probably, my personal favorite episode, the one I actually loved going through, oh man, that's hard to say, I loved every fucking single one of them, they're all great, uh, no, that's actually a difficult choice, but the worst episode in my opinion was this one, this one, I don't think the characters weren't as strong as the others, but, yeah, yeah, it's over, season one's done. And that's all to season two. Man. All into season two. Man. Alright. There it is. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching the Walking Dead series. This series was pretty odd. Siri, I didn't fucking say anything to you, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Why did you... I guess I said series and Siri came up and did one of the fuck you Siri. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Walking Dead. Man, this this is awesome. I love it. Personal favorite season. If I actually had to rate this season uh, like out of 10, this would be a 10 out of 10. I'm not even bullshitting you. This is a 10 out of 10 in my opinion. It's, it's a perfect fucking game. This is one of my 2012 game of the year. All five episodes yep one of my one of my personal favorite games of all time I still can't place but the, the three games go through number one last of us Red Dead Redemption 2 and The Walking Dead season one those three I can't ever choose man like the, the these are those are the three games I never choose from some some days it's the last of us some days it's Red Dead Redemption some days it's even Walking Dead season one but man going through it again is just it's so good you know, just it's so good. I think my personal favorite episode, if I actually had to choose it, might be Starved for Help or No Time Left or Around uh, the Corner or just Man. I don't know. These are all great episodes, but I think this one might be my favorite. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I need to wrap this up. We're losing time. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching the Walking Dead series. Stay tuned for season two, boys, because the whole ball, once we get into that one, the episodes get shorter and. Shit goes down. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.